I don't think God fucks with me. I've lost too much to have ever been loved right. Only thing I've got left are my dirty hands, and I don't ask God for much, y'all. Just one sunny day. So of course, the downpour begins. Half my family dies too far away for me to pray over their bodies. My parents still got bills they can't pay. The man I love ain't the man I love anymore. The pills stopped working. The self-harm returned after a three-year hiatus. So again, I ask God for the sun. Still, it rains. And y'all, my good boots broke last winter. And the man on the corner don't sell umbrellas no more. So now, I'm just a bloody puddle, but I feel like God wants me to make a whole ocean of myself. So last week, I came across this video of a woman getting her body stolen, a woman getting swallowed by a sword, and I think it was God sent it to me. And what a magic it was. This woman disappeared inside a mouth that wasn't a mouth. Her cry of confusion and fear and why me fell silent under the man's thunder. The man wiped his limp blade clean after. And if it weren't for his smug smile after finishing his trick, you'd forget she was there in the first place, which made it impossible for me not to remember every time I've lost my body in a man's need to colonize. My body must be a country I am indigenous to because I've never been able to call it my own. I remember wandering through these men's darkest rooms to find a way out, but there's never a way out because even when you're out, the darkness follows you back to your bed back to your lover's bed, back to where depression tucks you in at night, and y'all, it kisses me so gentle before it whispers how unworthy of a safe love I am, that no one will miss me when I'm gone. It paints pictures of me walking into oncoming traffic, wearing my favorite dress, and it goes on like this. I almost killed myself every day for 90 days and didn't. Now ain't that worth a blessing, God? Ain't that worth a holy flood, a hallelujah? So I pray for one, but God, don't say much. And if God is a man, of course he don't. And if God is a woman, then there must be a lesson here somewhere. And she wants me to live long enough to learn it. Amen. I keep hearing, I have to find the God in me first, but that means I have to find me first, and I don't know where I've been being these days, y'all. Don't know who to call a friend or lover or enemy, or just the wind, and there they all go again. Here I am, alone again, with my dirty hands, clasped together and begging, or prayer. They've been feeling like the same thing these days. Been feeling like I'll never see the sun again. <laughs>